My name is Charles Bush, and I'm a research administrator for the Office of Sponsored Research here at RIT. Grant Forward is a searchable database of funding opportunities. And in this presentation, I'll give an overview of Grant Forward and demonstrate some of its searching features. In this demonstration, I'm going to focus on funding opportunities such as scholarships and fellowships, which may be of interest to graduate students. Grant Forward can be used by anyone in the RIT community. The website is grantforward.com. Although anyone at RIT can use Grant Forward without creating an account, I'm going to recommend that the first thing you do is create an account because that will unlock several of the searching features. To create an account, go to the top right corner and click on the sign up button. From here, there's a few pieces of information you'll need to fill out. Make sure you use your rit.edu email address in the email field because that will link your account to the main RIT account. Then enter your name, create a password, and your user type will be student. So I'll now log myself in so that all the features are unlocked for the rest of the demonstration. Once you're logged into Grant Forward, there's a number of ways that you can search. As you can see, you have a search box which you can use for a basic keyword search. With this, you can type in any keyword or keyword combination, and it will bring up a number of funding opportunities that match your keyword search. I'll demonstrate with a keyword search on music history. Each result that appears is a unique funding opportunity. You'll see a brief snapshot of the funding program. And you can also click on the title itself for more details. Some of the important things to look for in a funding program are deadline, award amount, and eligibility. You can also go right to the program webpage, which will have more information about the opportunity, as well as details on how to submit your proposal. Some of the other features you can do with an account are to mark an opportunity as a favorite, and then go back to it later. And you can also email the program link to yourself or to others. So that's how you do a basic keyword search. One other feature you may find useful is to use filters to help narrow down your search. There's a number of filters on the left column. There are two that I think may be most useful for graduate students. The first is the grant type filter. Using the same results from our keyword search, you can use this filter to narrow these results down to only include certain award types such as fellowships and scholarships. You could also filter for other types of awards, such as travel funds or internships. Another filter you may find useful is applicant types. With this filter, you can narrow down results to awards made only to graduate students. Or you can combine filters for example, searching only for travel awards that are made to graduate students. Between keyword searching and filtering, Grant Forward should help you find funding opportunities in your discipline. That will conclude this demonstration, and I want to wish you good luck with your studies and scholarship.